What's up guys and welcome back to another video right onto my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to basically tell you how to uh, avoid this problem or fix this issue if you have a problem with starting or launching Total War Warhammer 3 and uh, stick to the end guys. This will be a step-by-step -step tutorial and in the end we will uh, perfectly know what to do in order to fix these issues. Before we start right into the video, I just want to you guys know, let you guys know that I would really really appreciate it if you would just leave a like, a comment or a subscription right onto my YouTube channel. It will really help me out and make my day, especially as a little YouTuber as I am. Subscribing would be a big support for me. I mean, it's free for you guys and would really support my work here on YouTube and my journey. So I'm gonna thank you for that right now and I would just say, let's get started. So in order to fix the issue, if you have starting problems, launching problems, whatever, I want you or I'm gonna recommend you to start your task manager first. So I want you to click the shortcut or you're gonna navigate down to the, bo to the bottom corner and um, right click the taskbar and opening up your task manager manager. So once you're here, I want you to stick to processes and uh, search for, so you're going to click one of those uh, processes and just type in war. So uh, W and search for Warhammer free. And if it didn't pop up or it doesn't pop up, it's perfectly fine for you. You're not going to do anything. And if something pops up, you're going to right click and anti task. So once you're here, I want you to close this one down. And next step is gonna be to take your shortcut from Steam on your PC and if you don't have it on your desktop, I want you to go to the bottom left corner of your screen, clicking the Windows sign and using the Windows search function in order to find Steam, drag it right onto your desktop and once it is on your desktop, I want you to right click it and go to the very bottom where it says properties. Once you, this window pops up, I want you to click on compatibility and basically just copy my settings. So um, you're gonna just, let's quickly run through it. I want you to uh, go to compatibility mode and enable run this program in compatibility mode four, select Windows 8, disable, this, disable full screen optimizations as well run this program as an administrator. You're gonna apply that and hit okay. I would personally recommend you to restart your PC afterwards and when it is restarted, you're gonna see this administrator symbol right on your Steam. Uh, you're gonna start Steam by double clicking it and launch your game over the launcher. This will probably fix your issue. That's it for the video guys. I hope I could actually help you out with this one. If it was like that, just leave a like, a comment or a subscription. Uh, I'm gonna thank you for that. I'm really sorry if I couldn't help you, but I'm just gonna do my best in order to help you guys and uh, I'm just sharing what it fixed it for me and many others. So either way, I hope you have a wonderful day. See you at the next one and bye.